Hello everyone, Jan here, and um, I and I'm going to do be doing my mango pickups for June. Um, I haven't really been on for a while, but I kind of make up for it throughout these time. I'm gonna be making a couple videos um throughout this month, and hopefully be back in in schedule. But um, for now, let's just start with this my pickups. First off is Full Metal Alchemist Volume 3, and I already have this on my shelf, but this is more like a replacement of um, my other one, because if, so, if you see my my Volume 3 that I have before I got this, it looks horrible. I don't even want to show you guys, but yeah, it's just bad, bad condition. Um, so this is just more of a replacement, so there's that. Favorite, My favorite series, by the way. Okay, um, next is Pretty Face Volume 2. Um, this is one of those, uh, oh, hard to find, by the way. For some reason, I'm having, like, a hard time finding these. Um, first volume, um, I found they're pretty cheap in a place I'm not gonna say. Um, but this one, um, got it on Amazon, I think. Um, if I remember, I don't remember right now, but, yeah. This is one of those series where... Um, that was a come because gen this is a gender bender, um, one and that has always been kind of a question mark for me. Like, uh, uh, it's uncomfortable and it kind of was as I read through the series. There's only six volumes, and I ca um, but it's funny. So that's that kind of it was it had a lot of comic relief. Like it's it's a comedy, so that kind of put the little, um, worry out of me out the window. So I liked it. I recommend it. Anyway, I'll talk more about it later. I guess. Another video. Um, next is Volume Twelve of Food Wars, and oh my god, and my obsessed with this. Every time there is a new chapter, I jump right on it, um, cause it's just so amazing. And I'm actually gonna be doing a, um, like a, what do I think so far of the, of the series so far, like two hundred plus chapter impression. Um, short, sometime in this month, so pretty good so far, and that was a good find. Next are volumes 1 and 5 of Nisekoi False Love, in Japan it's only called Nisekoi, but, um, okay, so I don't really dwell too much into romance, but in this, um, this is like the exception, it, it was recommended to, be, to me by a friend, um, and I gotta say, it is so. It was fantastic. I think there were, there's 25 volumes, 229 chapters, and it was fantastic. I read it back in like, during April, end of April, beginning of May, like around the time when I was finishing my, um, college classes. Um, but yeah, amazing. I'm also gonna be. I'm gonna be reviewing this sometime this month. So look forward to that. And then, last but not least. Um, volume 7 of 20th Century Boys, and this, I gotta say, is a masterpiece. Um, I, um, when I lived back in Florida, there was this, uh, public library that had the first 10 of these, and I just binge read them, but after that, I don't know, I got kinda lazy, and I just never finished it, so a couple years, fast forward a couple years later, and now, um, I find this, I'm like, dang, this completely reminded me that I, that I actually really enjoyed what I read of this, so this made me want to like go back and start rereading it, which I am. I I'm, I went I started going back and rereading them, and plus I'm gonna start collecting them. Well, um, so that was pretty much it for the month of June. Not much, I know, but still some good finds. All good finds, excellent, and I can't wait to collect more of these, especially Food Wars and these Sequoia. I'm gonna start jumping on collecting those too. But, yeah, um, if you like what you saw, um, and if you like, if you have anything to say of any of the series that I picked up, go ahead, I'd like to know, um, well, if you liked it, then you know what to do, and, well, see you next time.